Um, the first thing that comes to mind when talking about like using this hat as a different concept is working as a nurse at the Children's Hospital here in Alberta. I see a lot of, of injuries with winter sports and I find a lot of teenagers are more into fashion than they are into safety and a lot of them refrain from using helmets and they end up coming in and one of the most common injuries is, is brain injuries and head injuries. So I think if you can compromise with them and get them to wear something that's both fashionable and, and provides even a little bit more safety, it's definitely going to be beneficial for them. So I definitely think the Humpty hat may be a safer alternative to a straight toque with regards to preventing um, head injuries and brain injuries when, when participating in winter sports. Definitely. I definitely think this could be used for snowshoeing. I think it probably, it looks quite warm, so it, it fits the atmosphere, definitely. So it could give you some warmth. And um, like I said, in, in an activity that's not as risky, something such as snowshoeing, um, a more casual winter sport, I think this would, this would definitely be good for that.